Traditionally, for Christians, Advent is a time of looking forwards in anticipation that Jesus is coming back, that he's going to be returning. And we do that by remembering how he came, what it really meant that God came as a human being in history. And today I've been thinking about the theme of light and darkness, how Jesus is the bringer of light into a dark world. One of the most amazing prophecies about Jesus comes in the book of Isaiah. Hundreds of years before Jesus is born, Isaiah writes that people are walking in darkness. And on those people who are living in the land of darkness and under a great shadow, the shadow of death, a light has dawned. What does it mean that in Jesus a light has dawned? Well, I think as we think about the kind of darkness we're experiencing, it's winter, and we're in the midst of a time of physical darkness, and sometimes that physical darkness feels ominous. We may feel fear in a dark room or on a dark street. It may be that we're really aware of the political darkness of our times. There's great turmoil, not just here in Britain with questions about Brexit, but more broadly as we see uh, more authoritarian leaders arising around the world. We live in a time of moral darkness where seriously morally questionable things are happening. 40 million people enslaved in the world today. We perhaps live in a time, if we're honest as well, of spiritual darkness. If we look into our hearts, we, we sense, maybe through the presence of anxiety or, or other things, just an ominous sense that all is not well. The promise of Advent, the promise of the coming Christmas, is that Jesus is the light that has come for people who are walking in darkness and his birth is heralded by a light, a comet in the sky and angels who lit up the sky but it's prophetic, it's symbolic that he is the one who rescues us from darkness. So I wonder in your situation today if you need to remember that with hope light has dawned that's the way Isaiah puts it light has dawned we can look we can glimpse it and as we focus on Jesus we can perhaps welcome his light into our hearts